right, KTST, that was Graveville with Murder off their Metal of Death demo. Uh, we started off the set with Mutants of War off their Product of Corruption EP, Kill em with Speed, so those nice. are the tracks you heard. Yeah, that one's coming out on an album. Soon. Sometime when al- we get money. Yeah, he's actual My vinyl? God. <laughs> actual yep, he's gonna, vinyl. If you give me money to put on a vinyl, I promise I'll put it on a vinyl. Whoa, give me money. Right. Give me, give me, give me. No. Give me right some on. money. All right. I'm Benny the Breeze. Tanner Poppet. Michael Weikert. There you go. Yeah. It's your Thursday Night Thunder. Smack dab in the middle of the happiest freaking place on earth. In Poppet's Corner. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so. Hey, don't get too cocky there, Poppet. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, uh. You guys playing anywhere? What's your gigs? Yeah, what's, we, what's your I, next? I have, we have a couple gigs coming up. Um, right. I'll start with uh, some Madras gigs for you, and then uh, Mike will take it away on Mutants of War. Sure. Um, we have a gig tomorrow. It's free for 21 and over. Five bucks if you're 18 and over uh, with Witch Haven. 18 and younger? No, it's it's 18 and over. It's an 18 and over like place, yeah. Oh, so, so five bucks? So, yeah, for oh. them, and then tw- 21 and over, it's free. So oh. just come out and drink oh. with us. and. Uh, it's going to be a free show. Um, it's with Madrost, Witchhaven, Internal Corrosion, Fender's Ballroom Band. They'll play all the, the, the hits from the Fender's Ballroom Days. Nice. And then uh, a band called, I can't even pronounce it, but I'm sorry if I butcher it. It's it's Heretic Aside, I think. Her- heretic Aside. Yeah. Heretic Some, Aside? Yeah, but they're wow. on it, so come like, check it out, man. It starts at like 730. Like of Heretics. Oh, and I just oh. found out when we go on. We go on at 955. It's good to so. know. Yeah, Madras goes on at nine fifty five. So that's, that's pretty good to know. So uh, and it's come, up in L.A. Yeah, yeah it's in L.A. Um, yeah. So come out and uh, and hang with us. And then after that, we have a show next week actually at Maya's Cafe in Corona. It'll be a benefit show for the venue itself. Uh, we're playing with our buddies in Scoffin, uh, and an Expulsion and Brain Eater. So come on out and and support. So those are our, our next two for for just June. So sweet. I just gave you the June shows in uh, July and stuff. I'll. I'll tell all the shows for that too. and mutants of war right now we got june 29th uh down the street in fullerton at the riff house with hatchet out of the bay area so that's going to be a good one we got got some tickets for that and tormentor so, too right oh yeah, tormentor. With, with an e with what, what? with an e isn't it tormentor like the uh i have no idea okay <laughs> i think i think we're on it i, I know, know hatchet with an h from the bay area with a b and avenger and avenger of blood is avenger of blood is going to be there too okay so that's at the uh, riff house i will yeah. be there so come out and hang yeah so yeah support go, the scene there. go to our facebook and we can get you tickets for that all right what's the facebook uh facebook.com forward slash mutants of war Mutants of War. Yeah. How did that name come about? Is uh, it zombie no, related? No, we stole or? that right out from uh, from uh, M- municipal, municipal waste. waste? Yeah, okay. we just we just ripped that right off. Didn't think we were going to go this far, and then now we're just stuck with this this name. You're not really <laughs> stuck with any name, but it's formerly known as right. <laughs> the artists <laughs> were the <laughs> mediocre <laughs> artists formerly known as Mutants of War. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right, so you guys got some. You got your gigs coming up, Tanner. You got your gigs. Yeah, we coming have up. gigs coming up, and we're writing new material. Yeah. So yeah, look, be on the lookout for that. Oh, and tomorrow, if you do come out, I will be wearing something very special that I a don't tutu? really. A tutu? Not a tutu. No, no. I will be bringing back my pants. Oh, for those of you who no. who know who what what my pants are, yeah. and don't say it because I know you do. I'm not. I won't be it, wearing pants. Oh, okay, yeah. He'll, oh! he'll probably be wearing shorts or something like that. Sure, maybe I don't know. Sure. we'll see. Well, Josh we'll Rapp, see. Right? So, well, yeah. But uh, yeah, I will be bringing, I will be bringing back my pants. Nice. For a couple of shows, so come yeah. out, and if that's if that's what you want to see, then you know what, come out and support us. Dude. I just have to ask: Did you find them and wash them? Yep. Or I found them. I you? found them in, in Oz. <laughs> they vanished through the dryer and went to Oz. Yeah, so I, I had to go there to uh, to get it back. Nice, nice. So. All right. So what do we got next? Because uh, you know what, yeah, yeah. you guys are on. Cool, man. So um, yeah, I'm, I'm going to play back on your Thursday Thunder. Cool, man. Yeah, I'm going to play. Uh, we're going to play some some more uh, local acts for you. This band's out of Orange County, actually. This is uh, this is for for Roger and and Ed and Rose and and Gilbert. So this is Death Inquisition with the Eliminator. All right, on KTST FM dot com. Your Thursday Thunder. We're bringing it up now.
KTS TFM on you're on Thunder Thursday. Thunder, what isn't it? Uh, Something like your that. Thursday night thunder There's with Thursday Ben night, Breeze, yeah. All of a sudden, Tanner and Mike and we just right. we're just hanging so, out in the studio. That yeah, was yeah. that was Incinerator with Sabretooth, local band from uh, from Fort Worth, uh, Texas. We actually played with them in Texas, so 
Really cool but guys, that's not man. local, man. That is. If, yeah, it's a I, local Texas band. That, yeah, local. No. That, <laughs> still, keyword here is yeah. local. So, well, okay. uh, really cool guys, man. That goes that goes out to uh, to Chris and, and Ben and Juan. So, you know, nice. thank you for all for all your support, man. Uh, the track we heard before that was uh, our buddies in Scoffin' with uh, Fatality, which I think they're playing with you soon, if I'm not mistaken. Maybe they're playing with us at Maya's Cafe, which is. June 23rd, so come out. It's for a great cause. It's cheap. I think it's like five bucks. So right. come out and, and support. It's a three dollar uh, tall can of pops there, too. There, there you go, go, dude. Whoa! And, uh, <laughs> All the savings. Whoa! <laughs> and then, and then in July, actually, on the 13th, we were actually going to San Francisco for the first time ever with our buddies in Hatchet and Fog of War, and we were bringing along our buddies in Mutants of War. So they're going to be. Uh, coming on, along with us, we're going to be uh, playing some tunes, having some some drinks. So and, you guys uh, are going to caravan up yep, to San Francisco, do the whole we tour are. gig with the band guys, like these to do in the old days. Yep, Why don't you guys just rent a bus, man, or a motorhome? That'd be cool. You got one? Because we <laughs> I used to have one. <laughs> we're, uh, we're poor. <laughs> yeah, that is that. Unfortunately, that's what it comes down okay, to. Okay, so, so how do you, so what do you guys slept in your gear on your back and walking? Right. Yeah, like camels. Yeah, we put they them help. on camels. Yeah. <laughs> no, they don't have camels. We usually out. take horses. It's donkeys. We are. We're so poor. Well, we're so poor. We take donkeys because we right. can't afford horses. Why, so. why don't you just go down and get to the Home Depot and get the homeless guys? <laughs> <laughs> we just pay them or just yeah, pay them to you know, right. put the gear up. Um, I'm just kidding. But uh, actually, which is funny, um, so we'll be playing uh, July 13th in the Bay Area. Uh, my uncle uh, Andy and and I think Pete are gonna they're gonna drive down there Sweet. and uh, hang with us. So uh, shout out to them yeah. and uh, shout out to my buddy Mark Manzo, I think, who is listening in. Um, so yeah, uh, we're basically. I mean, that's for for July. After after that show, we're playing uh, August second with Fatality, and um, help me out here, Zombie Holocaust. Yes, those ones. That's you're playing that show too, yes. right? Okay, yeah. August second <laughs> at uh, Characters, Characters in Pomona. Right, Come it's on right out. by the train tracks. You and won't then, find uh, it. Yep. And then we're actually Absolutely. playing August fourth. With uh, Ex Mortis and Premonition and and uh, Fatality and Zombie Holocaust, so that'll be at the five uh, the five star bar in in Los Angeles. So yeah. come on out and uh, and support, man. So yeah. right the shows we have Doing coming good. up. And uh, I think you had something to say. I do. Okay, so Tanner Tanner let me pick a song off his debut album, Madras. So uh, here's my favorite one to play. Uh, what track is, is it? It's it's Under the Hammer, off of a. Uh, uh, of uh, Maleficent. Maleficent. I could never pronounce that. Thank it's you. cool, man. I couldn't pronounce your last name, so I. I uh, <laughs> <laughs> so you know what happens. It's we all can't rock and roll. We can't pronounce here. things, you know. Yeah. <laughs> so we're we're bringing that like mediocre spirit to radio. Yep. So. Uh, <laughs> so yeah, man. Uh, all right. Enjoy, so, man. So. This this is this, Mike. Pull this out again. What is it? All right. This is Under the Hammer from okay. Madrost.
ladies and gentlemen. There you go, your Thursday Thunder right here, KTSTFM.com. I'm Benny the Breeze. Got Tanner popping in here. Got What's going on, guys? Ma- Michael Wiker. Michael w- Wiker. Got- there you go. See? You, you, almost said, you almost said something else. I did, you know, I did. <laughs> that was my bad. But uh, we're, we are bringing you the some thunder. Up and com- yeah, thunder, up and coming, killer local bands yeah. and stuff. Yeah, that's what I'm. So that's what I'm here for, man. That's so. what the thunder's all about. I mean, you know, you've got me for a couple more hours. So sit back, relax, grab your cup of whatever it is you drink. Hopefully, it's of uh, it's of. Uh, you know, distilled. Di- yes, <laughs> a, a distilled flavor. A distilled beverage. There. Yeah. So uh, yeah, you you what you heard uh, before was actually Warhead. Our buddies in Warhead from, from Arizona. From I think Tempe, right? Phoenix, Tempe, Phoenix. Arizona. Okay. Uh, somewhere, nice. somewhere right there, but that somewhere goes out in the middle of the desert. But that goes out to uh, our buddies, our buddy uh, Nolan from uh, from Arizona. So cool. that was for you. That was the title track of their band. It was called Warhead. Although he doesn't deserve it, and if he's listening, <laughs> you know why. Oh, uh, wow. I think it's from that comment he made on Facebook. Right? Uh-oh. 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 Anyways, and then the Where's track you... Uh, are we already ba- are there already Facebook bashers? No, no. I mean, is that what the whole... And then, <laughs> and then the track you heard before that was uh, Madras with Under the Hammer from the uh, Maleficent album, the 2012. So yeah. uh, that was... Cool, cool. That was actually his favorite track, so we, we uh, put that on for him. Um, so... Yeah, right. man, we're just here supporting local bands, man. So you know, nice. check them out if you like them, dude. Go, so how go, go they, support, man. Tanner, how do they get a hold of you with the Facebook? The we're all just buddies. Madras, Madras, Facebook, or it's a Facebook or slash Madras M A D R O S T. You can find us on there if you want merch or anything like that. Please hit us up. You know, please support us and. Hopefully, we'll see you at the shows, man. You can come hang and and chill with us. Nice. You know, that's that's what it's about. Yeah. We're gonna do it like the uh, the old school style. In Mike, the olden days. Yeah. How do they get a hold of yeah. you, man? Um, same thing, except instead of Madras, you put mutants of war. Well, you can put right? us, but you'll probably find them through it yeah. too. So okay. we always we're we, friends. We actually, at least as far as Facebook, yeah, exactly, yeah, at least as far as I know, we are. You but, guys you know, can see the air quotes. You know, we always so, you know support each other and, and you know always well, yeah, try and I mean, that's go where to it travels, uh, right? I always go to other people's shows, and I know this guy does too. So that's that's what it's right. about. That's what I go to other people's shows because I have no show. <laughs> so, yeah, but yeah. that's okay because you're still supporting the scene. So thank you for that. <laughs> and hopefully, you, hopefully you can come out one one of these days. And, and I and am gonna make a point of just uh, going back hang out to with my, my old pops and, and you know just do all that it, fun man. stuff. Yeah, and just do it. You'll, you'll, maybe so. you'll see my dad in the uh, the Crypt Keeper outfit, dude. <laughs> nice with a shovel and stuff. Nice. Some. Uh, so yeah, man, it's always it's always a blast, dude. Go. Cool. I want to ask. I want to ask this guy something. Go. What is uh? What was your uh, your favorite gig that you ever played? I don't know. There's been a ton of them. Like you know? who? Like favorite lineup that you ever played? Well, back in the day, like uh, a couple of years ago, when the Mutant House was open, we got some like really cool ones. We got like Witch Haven and uh, Vector. I think Vector's first California gig was down down here uh, down in Chino. We played with them there. Oh, because uh, I played in Riverside with them a yeah. couple times at the uh, Common Ground. I don't think that's there anymore. So yeah, so I mean, some of those ones were like just these bands that we had headlining. Uh huh. You know, now, well, you guys owned the meeting house major though. Labels and stuff like that. So it's cool. You know, yeah, back, ba- in back in the day. Back in the day, yeah, this guy used to own a. Back in the day, you guys didn't even own like three, three years ago. Okay, was back in the back day. Back in the now. day for us is like three. <laughs> right. You'd be surprised. Not a lot of these bands are still with yeah, us. So, yeah, you know. I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, that back in the back when we were in high school. There you go. Let's put it that way. Almost Back when his, he almost dropped his beverage there. No, I didn't. Back when our drinking so, was close. irresponsible. <laughs> yeah, right. irresponsible. Irresponsible. Uh, now yep. it's responsible. Now yes. it's just boring, right? Yeah. So, um, okay, so cool. But, so you guys are coming up. I mean, I mean, you got your June schedule going. Mm-hmm. Yeah, all right. We're actually playing and, tomorrow with uh, with our buddies in Witch Haven and uh, Internal Corrosion and uh, Heretic Aside. And Fender's Ball and Band at the Joint. It's free if you're tw- over 21. So come but out it's and Hollywood. support. The Joint's in Hollywood. Yeah, right? it's in yeah. L- it's in L. A. Oh, Los I think Angeles. It's, I think it's oh. West of Hollywood. Yeah, it's like Los Angeles. Oh, okay. Like, uh, all right. I forgot where. I looked so, on a map and then I completely. Oh, this guy looked somewhere. Up. Somewhere, somewhere, somewhere in L. A. We'll by find Culver it. Culver City. Or we'll we'll, like we'll find it, dude. Oh, Santa um, Monica, Culver City. So, yeah, I know it's, it's area, like close yeah. to West Side. Nice. Oh, nice. So good luck with traffic, everybody. West Side. <laughs> Never. Mind. So, um, 
But yeah, man, All so right. that's going to be a fun gig. And then, you know, the uh, next week after at the uh, Myas Cafe in Corona, come out. It's going to be a benefit show. We're actually playing with our buddies in Scoffin. So if you liked what you heard, please come out and support. So yeah. we're going to be hanging just, you know. Awesome. Doing it like, uh, like we I always mean, do. You know, it, I, like I said, I got to have some time. I got to get out and, uh, you know, r- relapse into my metal. So uh, we'll we'll figure out what, what the whole gig goes on and we'll make it work. I mean... I like the local scene because that's where uh, everybody gets their chops. They go through the school. Well, that's, you know, where, you, that's so, where you get your start. Yeah. I mean, there would be no, you know, Megadeth or Metallica or any of those bands without starting, you know, small. Well, you got to support them to, you know, to where they reach their own audience. I played, and stuff. I played in the garage in the basement, and then uh, in I the still cellar. play in the garage in the basement. Yeah, well, because that's where they kept shoving us because yeah. <laughs> we're no. <laughs> You know you dang rock and roll. I don't understand it. That's just a bunch of noise to me, boy. <laughs> when you gonna get some uh, jugs in there and that that stringed old stick with it? With the bucket. Yeah, with the, bu- with the bucket. <laughs> then they call that it, uh, a one string bass. <laughs> well, we have a four string bass now, so we're all yeah, or a six string or a six string yeah. or a five string. So there you go. But uh, yeah, the track I would like to play now. Uh, if you if you like what you hear, please come out tomorrow and support us ah, and support sweet. the headlining band. This is our buddies in Witchhaven. Another this old. Is, this band. is yeah, another. I guess Why, what, they're not, what is that, old, not that old. Okay, what? so give me the the the, the, the year. That would mean that would mean we're old like, too, uh, dude. Like are we are o, we talking three oh four? Kind of like the okay, one, okay. one of the so, original right. bands in this little revival of thrash we have going here. All right, that that's what I'm asking. Revival of thrash. So all right, yeah. This is Wishhaven. This is the title track off their debut album. This is Terror Storm on yo, KT yo. ST.
KTSTFM and Heim's own net radio. Did I say it right? right? Yep. Right? Okay, good. You did. <laughs> All right, so who do we have? Practicing. Okay, that was Insentient with Decrepit Minds from their Remnants EP. Uh, before that, we heard, um, I'm going to butcher this, I hope not. Uh, <laughs> Mut- they're called uh, Mutalisk. It's M U T A L I S K. That one goes out to Jordan with uh, Noblesse Oblige. And before that, we heard Witch Haven with Terror Storm, which we're going to be playing with, which Josh is going to be playing with, uh, them and Internal Corrosion and, um, and all these good, great bands at the, uh, at the joint tomorrow. So come out and support, man. Right on. Always got to support your local music. Always. So, all right, Mike, come on. You look like you want to say something. I know. What do you want to say, dude? dude? I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's totally speechless. Oh, jeez. Well, left, um, left speechless by uh, Terror Storm. <laughs> That was that was dude. That's a great album, man. Good one, yeah. Yeah. So uh, I liked it actually because like they got I was the saying, black metal I was, feel yeah, to I it. I went back stuff. into my you know yeah. my old uh, you know like I said, Cannibal Corpse, Sepultura, you know you know Slayer. They're from the know. IE, just like me. So, oh yeah, yeah, they're from but, yeah IE bands. But that's what they listen to to get it, where they're at. Yeah. It's crazy, dude. IE and then Orange County. Like yeah. I don't know how we met, but uh, come it's on, crazy. it's the scene. Yeah, I guess so, man. It's the scene. So. I got something that's. I know you, you know got a, you got a fly like bugging. It's like I think yeah, your nose there, it's, dude. It's it's. Oh no! <laughs> uh, I really? Think it, I think it did, dude. I think it caught up his nose. <laughs> Is it in there? <laughs> All right. So. Son of a. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, and then also too, um, uh, uh, Metal Invictus is having a show. Uh, that's uh, my drummer's um, like little company. Him and his wife uh, are promoters. They they promote right. the uh, local scene with no pay to play. Okay. So if you want uh, no pay to play and you want to play in L.A., go through Metal Invictus. They'll uh, they'll hook it up. Okay, um, run that by Metal Invictus. Invictus, yeah. Okay, dot com or no, dot org. No, just uh, Metal just... Invictus on on Facebook. They just, oh, I think okay. it's just a Facebook. Okay. Uh, but yeah, go look them up if you need like help, uh, any help booking shows and Hell stuff yeah. in the L.A. area. Right on. Um, so they'll they'll help you out there. And then uh, yeah, they have a show I think with Scoffin and uh, our buddies in Death Inquisition, which uh, we actually just we played them a, a little while ago. So if you like it, if you liked what you heard, uh, please go check it out. It's at the uh, Airliner on uh, on Father's Day actually. So happy Father's Day to all the dads out there, and happy Father's Day to uh, to my pops out there. So yeah, so I gotta go on, deep sea fishing and talk yeah. to my dad. <laughs> <laughs> but and then there's actually um, another show in uh, and I think it's in L.A. It's it's free. It's it's Hyrax. And Bonded by Blood, who we're going to play here in a minute for my buddies uh, Morrow, Juan, uh, Jesse, and Carlos. So um, Sweet. I think that's we, actually at the Century Media Yeah, it's a Century Media yeah, headquarters thing. So hopefully we can uh, put our CD in the right hands there. Um, uh, so, yeah. Nice. That'd be awesome. You know, so. you know, <laughs> <laughs> it's over here. Tanner's licking his chops. He's yeah. rubbing his fingers back and forth going, <laughs> oh, it's going to make it happen. I'm going to make it happen. I'm going to put in the right hands. Hopefully. You know? Yeah. Hopefully. So we, we have a bunch of help, luckily, from uh, fans and supporters like you guys who are tuning in. So thank you very much for that. Yeah, thanks and, uh, for the listeners, you know, the new guys. And uh, thank you for, for having us, by you're the way. You're welcome, and you're any time, like I said. Hopefully anytime. we'll be coming on, you know, next month to, to sure. play some more metal for you, and I'll, I'll have a bunch more uh, local bands for Shamelessly you to uh, Why don't we just, yep. why, why don't we, uh, we'll talk about it after this show, 
and then we will make a list and we will tell the listeners. There you go. And then that way we'll have it on the same day or you know the third week the first week the second week whatever and just have a full on uh you know metal make, session yeah, yeah and make I'll bring the metal set the local I'll, metal and I'll bring session. some I'll bring somebody else in you yes. know to like support their band sure and, so you know that would work out if, for uh, me if right? anybody wants to be on the radio please get in touch with me on the world at, at, uh you can look no, my you name up me $50. it's uh, we'll it's split it it's oh, okay. Tanner Poppet. Yeah. <laughs> Mike, so, stop making uh, money. <laughs> so look, look me up. It's Tanner Poppet. T A N N E R P O P P I T T. And uh, just hit me up if you want to, you know, be on it in uh, Anaheim. Just uh, give me a, give me a, a shout. So sweet. So uh, uh, I would like to play next for all the listeners of a band that's helped my band out a lot. So they they very supportive and they're kind of a bigger name out there actually. They're signed to Century Media. We're going to play some uh, Bonded by Blood off the Aftermath with my buddy, our buddy, Morrow. He left us. He, he left Means of War for, for Bonded by Blood, so we're going to, you know, we support everybody. <laughs> That's right. I guess. I guess we will. I guess. Morrow. I will. I don't, I don't know about him. Okay. I will. I love you, Morrow. So uh, this is, this is That's Shepard's. That's a lie. That was so faded right there. <laughs> I know. I know. That he's was a liar. so faded. He's a liar. He's a liar. Good God. Anyway, this is uh, Shepherds of Rot off the, uh, the Aftermath All right, record. what track are we on? What, what disc Th- am I on? Um, number, uh, the one we just played or whatever, it's, it's the next track after that. All right, so, so it's nine? Yeah. All right. You're, well, on, you're, on, you're on ten right now. I've only got uh, some things to do, but uh, here's what I got. Okay. All right. The Indie Entertainment Summit's coming up. I know it's a little while away, but uh, it's August 7th through the 11th. It's in South Hollywood. It's a five-day event. Anything you want to do in the industry, regardless of what it is, whether you want to be an announcer like moi, but I doubt you do. And, uh, you know, photography, anything in the industry, it's the Indie Entertainment Summit. It's been going on for a long time. Jay Warzynski, uh, it's his 40th anniversary, so go out and support it. You know, he's broke bands like ACDC, Guns N' Roses, stuff like that. Been in the been in the industry, and there was no way... Really, he came up with a thing for people to meet and greet uh, to get their wares out in the, you know, in the summit anywhere, you know, in the industry. So anything you want to do, they have in-depth seminars. They also have workshops, movies, concerts, whatever, uh, whatever you want to do. Go to IESFest.com. Five-day package is $199. What was that? Can you and, repeat uh, that? Yeah, one ninety nine. <laughs> one ninety nine. Five days. All right, <laughs> and it's in South Hollywood. You know, the tra- the tram ride is free for wherever you got to go to, but if you miss it out, they've got videos of all the stuff. Uh, they have movies. You know, like I said, they're going to do some honorees. Uh, I, I do believe they're doing Motorhead this year, and. Oh, uh, Gee, I can't even remember who else is going on there, but uh, you know, last year we had Guns N' Roses out there, so it was pretty good. But I'll be out there on the ninth, sitting on a panel. Uh, try not to be, you know, as drunk as I am. No, I'm kidding. Uh, not as uh, brain dead as I. Oh, wait, punch drunk? No, never mind. But go to <laughs> iesfest.com and check it out for all your info. And uh, it is August seventh through the eleventh. All right. Now, just before we get into Tanner stuff. And his killer music. I've got. To oh, you got play. something? I, well, I, 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 I want to make a quick shout out to uh, Metal Load, by the way. Uh, so thank you guys for supporting us too. Go check out Metal Load. Uh, they support metal, so go check them out. What's the name of them? Metal Load. Like we metal just we just dropped our lo- oh. we just dropped our Metal Load. Oh, this is insane right here. He's, pre- he's pressing yeah. buttons, so I'm going to give I some shout-outs. Yeah, so go, so go, go. So uh, go check him out. It's, uh, it's Metal Load at uh, you know, Facebook.com. <coughs> Just type in Metal Load, and uh, they support everybody. So Cool. To uh, to Liz and uh, Laura and Leno, so we love you guys. So thank you very much for supporting Madras, Means of War, and all the uh, killer bands out there. So Awesome. All right, we're going to step away for just a sec. We'll be back. Cool. It's your Thursday Thunder, KTST FM, and I'm Zone. Net Radio. And you know what? That it is far and wide. It's border to border, coast to coast, and around the world at KTSDFM.com. We're smack dab in the happiest frickin' place on earth, Anaheim. Gray Eagle Tower, this is Freedom 2-3, inbound at 20 miles. Fuel state critical. Request a ready deck. What if the American military were cut in half? Who would be there to protect us? Gray Eagle 
Eagle Tower, Freedom 23 sees you at 10 miles, declaring a low fuel emergency. Come in, Gray Eagle Tower. Who would be there for rescue operations, humanitarian relief efforts, and peacekeeping missions? Freedom 23, a beam, hook down, gear down, fuel state critical. Do I have a ready deck? This year, the National Guard and Reserve will again make up half of our American military forces. Freedom 23, this is Gray Eagle Tower. You have a ready deck, winds on the nose at 20 knots, keep it coming. As soldiers, sailors, airmen, and Marines, they'll be in a position to support our country. As their employer, so will you. For more information on how you as an employer can help, contact your state committee at our website at www.esgr.org. A public service message from the Employer Support of the Guard and Reserve and the Ad Council. When you give blood, you give another birthday, another summer vacation, another concert, another date, another dance, another day at the beach, another night under the stars. When you give blood, you give another holiday with the family. Another sunset after supper. Another talk with a best friend. Another laugh. Another hug. Another chance. This is Brooke Shields for the American Red Cross. Please give blood. A public service message from the Ad Council.
KTST FM, Anaheim's O Net Radio. This is Tanner Poppet of Madrost. And it's Michael Weckert from Mutants of War. Nice. And I'm Benny the Breeze from your Thursday Night Thunder. Thank you, Benny, for there having us go. on. We're You're getting this down. You're welcome. So, okay, so here's. We're slowly the, learning how to be interviewed, too. Yeah, well, slowly. Here's what I got a question What is the most 
uncomfortable moment you've had on stage, whether it be a malfunction or feeling you're naked or, you know, or there's you, you can't see out there and they don't show the audience and there's like two or three people? Uh, what is it? <laughs> well, I've had plenty of those. I won't talk about those <laughs> because I might get in trouble. But uh, there was one time, actually, I think we played the Riff House, and my old, our old bass player actually um, hit me over the... All right, KTST FM, Anaheim's O Net Radio. This is Tanner Poppet of Madrost. And it's Michael Weckert from Mutants of War. Nice. And I'm Benny the Breeze from your Thursday Night Thunder. Thank you, Benny, for there having us go. on. We're You're getting this down. You're welcome. So, okay, so here's. We're slowly learning how to be interviewed, too. Yeah, well, slowly. Here's what I got a question What is the most uncomfortable moment you've had on stage, whether it be a malfunction or feeling you're naked or, you know, or there's, you, you can't see out there and they don't show the audience and there's like two or three people. Uh, what is it? <laughs> well, I've had plenty of those. I won't talk about those <laughs> because I might get in trouble. But uh, there was one time, actually, I think we played the Riff House and my old, our old bass player actually, um, Hit me over the the head on accident, of course, because we were getting, you know, we were doing our thing, and uh, yeah, I got smacked with the bass, and uh, that happens a lot. That hurt. I, I almost got knocked out. It's yeah. an I, like, stage? I, I fell to the floor. Yeah. Luckily, I was like, kind of, pl- I was playing a little bit, you know, and then like I slowly got back up and finished the set. But man, that was awful. Yeah, it's an occupational awful. hazard. Morrow from Bonded by Blood, we just listened to. We, he when actually he was, used to be yeah, their singer. He he so. was the best at like finding a way to nail himself in the face with whatever headstock was he around. Still, he still is. Yeah, he still just, is like that, so yeah. it's great. He just bounces off of it and smiles. Nice. Right. So, but yeah, that's that, I mean, what... That was that was yours? You got, well, hit, in the head? You got hit in the head as no, well? No, I mean, me? that happens so much, it doesn't even phase me anymore. Oh, yeah, well, right? dude, trust me. I, I mean, I've been getting dumb because of it, too, you know? It's not... Yeah. Not, it's not the beer or anything. It's from getting in, no, yeah. in the head with a uh, You get a chunk hurt. of your hair in somebody else's like, yeah, machine Yeah, I've gotten that, too. Happens, right? I've, I've gotten that, too. Uh, nice. I almost fell off the stage once. That sucked. I've never done that. I think... I think it's because I get down too much, so, I, like, you know... I, he, he does get down. So, I don't I don't know what it is, dude. But do you get back up? I do. Okay. That's I get important. Back. So yeah, yeah. yeah. No, yeah. I, I, fi- I make sure and finish the uh, the show. So yeah. sweet. The people people paid money to see us play. Uh, I'll give them one a show. question. Okay. Have you ever stepped on a monitor and had it go forward? Uh, sort Mar- of. Mario has. I yeah, Mario's fallen off I, the stage. I remember. I remember seeing videos of that too. Okay. Yeah. With a Madras shirt. <laughs> so it was awesome. <laughs> nice. So. The, the, the good times, man. I, oh, hope yeah, to, yeah. I hope to have some more good times like that, too. Uh, so. I've broken a monitor. I've had it, like, bend in, but I've never fallen. Oh, so it's Marl's never raised fallen. up when you put your foot on there yeah. and you really Almost. get into it. Almost. Okay. Mar- Marl did that at the uh, whiskey, though. I've never quite, like, like taken a dive off stage or anything. Usually my embarrassing moments are, like, busted strings or when certain people who are no longer in the band are making mistakes. Yeah. I can I can vouch for that. That'll yeah. happen. Okay, Look, but a busted string, you just go to a different fretboard. Different. No, usually not when you, you have a Floyd Rose. Oh, because then your your whole not, thing is yeah. and not when you and, and if and and only if if you bring another guitar. Which, true. I often forget. Like, yeah, we'll bring one for right. it tomorrow. La- last time we played Trust at me. the Riff House, I didn't break a string. Steve broke his string <laughs> for like five minutes. Right, we were sitting there like waiting for him to change it yeah. and stuff. And yeah, I was. I had, was to, I had to play the song, which was a new song. It was a song he wrote, so it's a song he no- normally like takes the lead on. Yeah, and like I kind of like covers up my mistakes, and all of a sudden it's like now I have to he play has, it. He all has by to do myself. that all tomorrow too. Like, oh boy, <laughs> nice. So that's why you practice. Yep, yeah. yeah. practice makes perfect. Right? Yeah. No, it don't. It does because you can practice all your life and still screw shit up. Yeah, Stuff if you practice, to, it, practice to a metronome, then, yeah. then you'll get better. Yeah. But, um, yeah, I want to make another shout-out to uh, Mr. Andy Ford sure. of uh, The Joint for having us, too, man. He actually asked us um, to play this gig tomorrow yeah. on the air when I was there, like, I think a couple months ago. So. Sweet. It was pretty cool, actually. And uh, shout-outs to my, my uh, bandmates, uh, Cesar Escobar and Richard Oriana. So hopefully they're tuning in or napping, one of the two. 
Hopefully they're napping because I know Richard uh, <laughs> worked all day. He was tired, so, you know. And uh, uh, shout-outs to uh, all Mutants of War besides nah, Mike. Nah. I don't, I'm not going to give Mike a shout-out. Nah, don't give them shout-outs. No. What? Really? He's very, I'm mean. I, like, he's tough love, harsh, man. Yeah. Tough yeah. love. Oh, nice. Yeah. You have to earn my right? stuff. Yeah. See, that's why that's why he's here with me. I guess I've earned it. So, so right. you, so you're actually a guitar player and a vocalist. No, or no, no. just guitar. No, our, our, I just play uh, lead guitar. And yeah, our vocalist was Morrow. Now we got a guy, Ian. Yeah. Who, who rules? By the way, that guy Ian's rules. Awesome. Yeah. yeah, he was actually in a band with uh, with Henry, who's now in Witchhaven. We just heard Henry and, and yeah. Dan of uh, of X X Mortis. Right. Yeah. So. Yeah. <laughs> lots okay. of lots, lots of bands lots of, going way back. Yeah. All so right. I want to ask you, who are your influences? Um, for everybody out there right? listening, uh, you know, I think it's kind of obvious when you listen. You know, there's some Metallica in there. There's oh, you some, like Stevie uh, Nicks? Megadeth, Stevie Nicks, obviously, right? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> probably some because uh, you can go your some, own way. Nicki Minaj or some some, some, like that, some right? Blondie or what? Yeah, uh, no, mostly mostly like Kesha. Oh, okay. Like Kesha. I, yeah, that, that's cool, man. You know, uh, some Tony Spears. Basil. All, some, the, all the classics. Some Frank, Frank Sinatra or what? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> hey, Frank good. Sinatra is awesome, by the yeah, way. Yeah, he is. Yep, yep. Some Stevie I have, Ray Vaughan. I have no problem playing Frank. Some, uh, so MC Steve, Hammer. Stevie Ray Vaughan. Yeah, Stevie Ray Vaughan. What, did, you know, what, Vanilla Ice, probably one of your influences. Yeah, maybe. but on, only only before he went metal. Oh, right? okay. Yeah, yeah I well, was just wondering. So you, like the, so the wait, wait, you like Michael Bolton? Yeah, man. Oh, yeah. Because he went metal. <laughs> Oh, he, he, dude, he sneezed. Oh. The listeners out there, he sneezed, sneezed his headphones so off. loud the headphones came off. Dude, it, I think it was that fly, man. It came yeah, back, dude. It happened. That fly just yeah. came back and bam. They do. They do. So, knocked his headphones right off there. It did. Yes, So did. um, So, yeah, man. But uh, he recovered. Just, he did recover, so. Who's re- Oh. You you recovered there. Yeah, that's <laughs> that has to do with drugs and alcoholism. I'm not recovered there yet. <laughs> okay. And I then, only cover... I, I also no, want to ask you, uh, how's the uh, record going? Because I know you have something coming. Yeah, that's up right. You got a new, you got some new gig yeah. going on, right? And you get, you guys. Well, are, it goes. He, he refuses to tell us. Right. Yeah, ask him. We got it. Well, the problem we got tons of it done. Tons and tons of it. it sounds good, but you know, there's like ninety percent. Because I've heard not, a couple yeah. of tracks and it's awesome. So. Yeah, you just got you know. Without the uh, vocals, I haven't heard when, the vocals. When yet. we're doing it ourselves, it kind of uh, we don't have anybody fronting us money, so it go it, it Dude, goes it, and then it stops when we run out of funds, and then yep. we're, we're hoping to get it back uh, going again and finish up the, the leads and the vocal tracks this summer hopefully get it mastered and stuff within the year right on that'd be good heck yeah well cool. dude it took 14 months for for us to put out you know maleficent who we, i'm probably going to play another track on it like right now so <laughs> why not this actually is, it's it's yeah it's a it's, top one top one it's and not not number seven no but i we, will, ju- we just played that yeah <laughs> Uh, actually, I want to play something that like is very obscure on the album. I would like to play track four. Track four, if you if you for the, all the uh, listeners out there, this is a you know, song you might know. This is good old fashioned violence on KTST FM Anaheim's own Net Radio. It's your Thursday Thunder.
All right, you're on TakeOver Thursday, Thunder, with your host, Tanner Poppet. <laughs> we're close. We're getting there. We're, we're, we're getting there. You're, you're on yeah. Poppet's Corner right now, so uh, we're about to uh, do some, uh, some metal for you, so uh, it's going to be good. Uh, what you heard before was uh, a couple tracks off uh, Madras's Maleficent album, which was released on in uh, May second or March second, two thousand twelve. I remember because I was there. Yeah, you actually played the release show yeah. with us. So Whoa. that was uh, <laughs> that was some uh, good old fashioned violence for you. And after that, we heard Drawn and Quartered. So. They, uh, yeah, they actually released you guys. Yeah, they, they released. They us. released themselves. Yeah. Oh, yeah. really? We had a release show. Yeah. So everybody took over the asylum and just released yourselves. Yeah. Yep. Nice. We took it over like Anthrax did. <laughs> so, nice. So yeah. So thank you again for listening to uh, uh, Thursday Thunder Takeover. Yeah, KTST. Because I'm, I'm, uh, I'm just taking running the over. Board. Yeah, I'm just running the board with That's your all uh, I did. with your host Tanner Poppin, and with me I have uh, Mr. Mike. I'm sorry, I can't. He, he can't pronounce. I can't right pronounce right. his last name. Right. So what is it? It's Weikert. Weikert. Yeah. I want to say something else, but uh, yeah, right? it's not going to. Doesn't happen. look like it. Doesn't. Look, nope. And then okay. I have, uh, you know, Benny oh. the Breeze, who's overlooking me. So, <laughs> so thank you again for I'm the he's judgment. Figure, yeah, but silent over he, here. He's yeah. giving me the no, okay no. to do this. Yeah. So we really appreciate it, man. Yeah, no worries, man. Anytime. Us, letting us play, uh, you know, local bands that I feel deserve to be played on the radio. That you know, not a lot of stations play. Hint, hint. Or no stations. Or no stations. Yeah. Hint, hint. So, um, you know, we're gonna play them. So you dang right. It's gonna be awesome. So uh, yeah. Thank you again for for tuning in. We have we have about another hour. It's seven fifty on uh, KTST. No, we got till nine. Oh, I'm just telling them. I'm just telling the time. You're probably about right. It, it, do you want to do traffic now? No, yeah, I'll do. I'll Should do the do weather. Traffic, yeah. <laughs> Look it up on your iPhone. And, and some weather and, and uh, stuff. It's uh, seventy five degrees in uh, in uh, Anaheim. Uh, seven fifty. You're listening in to uh, KTST. We're about to play some some more metal for you, I think, hopefully. What do, yeah. what do you got there? You well, said you had New Sabbath, right? Yeah, but I, I, I have to run through these. Oh, there's some, so, some PSA announcements. Yeah, I, yeah. Well, no, I have to pay a few bills here oh, and there. Okay. So we're going to run through those. There you go. And we shall be return for your uh, you Poppet's Corner. Poppet's Corner. <laughs> yeah. yeah. There's a night, right. Thursday night takeover. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I am not in bondage, nor am I in handcuffs. I'm just letting it happen. It's KTST FM and I'm so net ready on Betty the Breeze. We shall return. Another great place to use Visa. They say that on the Champs Elysees in Paris, the brioche are so delicate and the pan au chocolat so delicious, you'd almost think you were at Pike Place Market in Seattle, where you'll find Le Panier, one of the finest French bakeries around. But if you want a taste of Le Panier's world-class casse croute, bring a discerning palate and your Visa card. Because at Le Panier, they take baking to an art, but they don't take American Express. Visa, it's everywhere you want to be. It sits there looking like a candy bar in a nice orange wrapper, right? Reese's nut rageous. Then you take a bite and it blows your eyeballs to Pluto, kicks your ribs to the roof of your mouth, pounds your taste buds into a simpering puddle of pulp, and leaves you for dead. Want one, don't ya? Reese's nut rageous, so loaded. Chocolate. You don't eat it, you survive it. Hi, right, down here. It's your mouth. Listen up. Let's get some things straight, okay? A, I'm not a bottle opener, all right? B, wait until the pizza cools down. I'm tired of having the roof peel for three days. And for Pete's sake, buy me some cool mint Listerine. It's proven to kill the germs that can cause gingivitis, which, by the way, two out of three mouths get before we're 25. So get some, huh? Otherwise, you might find me, your mouth, saying a little something unexpected on your next date, like, Hi, my name's Mike, and I just love biting my toenails. Capiche? See your dentist. Use as directed when brushing and flossing aren't enough. All right, we're back, and that's the way it rolls around here. Thursday Night Thunder, 
Ah, the takeover by Tanner Pop. The ta- takeover. takeover Thursday, it's a Thursday Pop- takeover. Yeah. We're There's a thunder the takeover on Poppet's Corner, so <laughs> we're gonna we're, we're actually gonna play some some new stuff for you uh, right now from an uh, old band actually called King Cobra, which is Carmine a Pieces band. Yeah. Um, what's uh what what do you what do you got there? What's uh, what's the name of that album there? You know, I actually cannot remember what the hell of it is <laughs> because I just was throwing it in there, and uh, I just think it's called. Uh, Actually, I think it's called King Cobra. Oh, okay, so it's a self-titled. I, I actually think that's the name of the album. Okay, so we're gonna I mean, play. They've, the... had a, they've had a couple that are self-titled, but uh, how do you have always... a couple albums that are that? That makes no sense. Very confusing. That is, well, you had Led Zeppelin one, Led Zeppelin two. There Led... you go. So you have King Cobra one, King Cobra two. Could be. <laughs> Look it up. I was gonna do that, but I, obviously I got lost. You would what like so... Be- Benny the Breeze one, Benny the Breeze two. Yes. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Man. Well, when they gave my padded cell away at Bellevue, I was like number two. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, we're gonna play some King, uh, some King Cobra for you. And after, yeah. I would love to hear some some new uh, Sabbath since you have. Oh, uh, I got that too. So I want to hear some. And I have a five word, well, five words or less review on that one too. I actually really like it. Yeah. Besides Ozzy's vocals, I think are a little bit well, overproduced. Bill, here's, here's the there thing. There is no Bill Ward. I get that. Uh, yeah, but yeah. It, the riffs so it's are. Not, the, but the riffs yeah. are there. Does the riffs it's, are still yeah, there? Yeah, it's still BS. <laughs> but the riffs are still there. So All right. There you go. Mike, weigh in. Uh, I, don't know. <laughs> I think as, Tony Iommi has been writing riffs without anybody to record right. them for like thirty years now. So and Tony Martin stuff. At least rules he's getting too. It out there. Yeah. Tony Martin stuff rules. I do miss the Bill Ward. That was all the groove. Yeah, that so. was. But. Uh, but see, that's what I'm saying. If help a brother out, these well, guys wait, are all rich. He's not. He's hold riding on, a bike, a collecting cans. I heard. I heard that he physically cannot do it anymore. Yeah, that's what I heard too. So I heard both I, rumors that he just couldn't play anymore. So and he can't do I, it. I so. hope that's not the case. I mean, I hope because yeah. I would love to see that. That would be, I, that'd that be would, awesome. That would be Black Sabbath back to Black Sabbath. Well, I mean, and I saw. I mean, I feel I saw the best Sabbath period. Yeah, I saw the Dio Sabbath, so I think yeah. I feel like I saw the best of the what best. Dio with Rainbow, come on. I, Dio with Dio, come yeah, on. I know. I think Dio, yeah. whatever he touches. I think is yeah, awesome. I think whatever he touches. But he's gone too, right? It's, it, that's why I saw the best. He's wearing sparkly shirts but, in heaven but, now. But uh, before we go, I'm gonna what give about a, hell? I'm gonna give Maybe. us Maybe. a, se- a shameless uh, shameless plug right here. So go. before we go, so. Um, Facebook.com slash Madrost, M-A-D-R-O-S-T. Go check us out. Let us know what you think. And then, then you go over to Facebook.com forward slash Mutants of War. Yeah. And go check them out. Go support. I think you have a, like a couple shirts left, a couple EPs. Yeah, and we're we- coming out with new shirts. Oh, oh you got to so send good. me some of that. Yeah. Oh, I will. Oh, and I, I, and, uh, I, I got to support. I got a sweatshirt out of this guy. Yeah, we gave him a free sweatshirt. <laughs> so. They're cozy. Yeah, oh, yeah, we have beer cozies now, too. Oh, jeez. So... Yeah, um, I gotta keep stuff cold. Yeah, there you go, dude. So, <laughs> but yeah, we have we have all that stuff. I think we have a couple albums left. We desperately could use you know the, the funds for more stuff so we can get new CDs and oh, I more merch. I got support. I got so some money. Hopefully, um, you can you know help give, us out there and, and uh, get up to San Francisco. Yeah, there get, you go. There gas you go. Money. So, gas yeah. money. to Get up to San Francisco. Whatever you whatever you can do, man. Just please support us and support the scene. So that's yes. what we cool. want to do. And. And we're going to play a, a, a couple of tracks from the founding fathers of the whole scene in general after some King Cobra. For sure, you. no on worries. KTST on Thursday Night Thunder. And ladies and gentlemen, your Thursday Thunder right here at KTST FM and I'm on that radio. I'm in the breeze. Would Tanner Pop- Takeover. Yeah, it is. <laughs> yes, it is. Because- Pop its Corner. Yeah. Brought to you by Schlitz Moment. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> Schaefer, maybe. Black <laughs> Label. <laughs> <laughs> Some uh, Sailor Jerry's or Captain's. <clears throat> oh, wow. So... Uh- okay, but you know what? We all... What- we just played some King Cobra. Yeah, what tracks were those? Well, who cares? <laughs> it was... Off the new, the new uh, King yeah, Cobra Yeah, brand album. new King Cobra. With uh, uh, Carmine, yeah, Carmine a piece, yeah, Carmine because Vinny Apice is and yeah, Carmine a piece, yeah. yeah. But anyway, they're both drummers, yeah. And I've seen some. Uh, I'm glad he came back out because I do believe I saw him at the Brixton with a band called Big Noise. Probably he's in like fifty well, thousand bands. This was he's uh, like, uh, Joe he's Lynn like Mike Turner, Portnoy, dude. Yeah, this was Joe Lynn yeah, Turner. Probably. This was. Uh, 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 Rudy Carvaza, the the bass player for Rudy Sarzo. Uh, so that's it for uh, no no no. 
Yeah. Rudy Sarzo from Quiet Riot. Riot. Yes, that's it. Yes. <laughs> because I also went and saw... He's in like 50,000 bands, yeah, too. Yeah, I know. I was just thinking of the other guy who I saw who likes to slap his bass like a woman. Uh, never mind. <laughs> but he, he's all, that guy's really awesome, too, man. Yeah, he's like, okay. I was going to say but, something, too. Like, when... when uh, before... Oh, yeah, I, I was going to... Uh, we're gonna play some Sabbath here in a minute uh, from the new uh, the new record. Yeah, thirteen. Thirteen. Yeah. So, but w- I have some stuff on YouTube. Yeah, we'll, we'll play that, we'll play some YouTube that, stuff right now. We are we're because gonna, it's true. But, it's, tr- it's true. It's <laughs> true. <laughs> I can confirm this. So, well, Mike. Yeah, it, you, so you, shy, you man. introduce I mean, it, man. Come I, on. I'm, I'm waiting for the setups. I no, do the that, that was the oh, setup. You're the one, oh, yeah. you're you the kinda, one liner? You, you kind of missed the boat on that. So oh, what is what is, what what is the song <laughs> called? <laughs> All right, this song is actually the uh, title track from our EP. Uh, it's Product of Corruption. And this one's going to be on our album that's coming out at Soon. some point in Soon. the future. Okay. Unless I crash my car. <laughs> oh, please. Right? Really? But, uh, okay. One day. And? You, and yeah. you guys don't have a title for it yet, too, right? No, the album doesn't have a title. It's not going to be called Product of Corruption. Oh, okay. That's the EP. But yeah, so, um, so this is with our old lineup, uh, Mauro, who's now in Bonded by Blood, and our old And drummer. a couple of the members that are still in it. And right? so, yeah, um, our old drummer, Darren, who's like not on the, not on the new album. So yeah. it's going to be a little bit different, but here's a little taste. It's still, still going to be good, man. Anyway. You're listening to KTST on Thursday Thunder Thursday Night Takeover. So, this is Mutants of War, the product of corruption on KTST.
All right, ladies and gentlemen, that was Black Sabbath. God is dead off uh, their newest album, 13. You're on a Thursday night takeover with your host, Tanner Poppet, on Poppet's Corner. And joining me is Mr. Mike. I can't even uh, pronounce You got to hit the button there. Oh, there. So I'm sorry. Weichert. Weichert. We're working on it. We're getting the glitches out. We are slowly but surely there, but uh, I have taken over the, uh, the hot seat here. Yeah, and, we've actually uh, we've actually kicked Benny just right off his mic. Yeah, even though he's standing right behind us. So, uh, you, but yeah, man, what what did you think of it? Thought it was good. Yeah, I'm like I'm glad they can write nine minutes of material and not be boring. Oh, it's awesome. Well, Although, so but so can you though. That's just just <laughs> not true. No, no, it's, it's you're true. young, they're old. No, it, it's true. Trust me. But uh, yeah, man. So uh, we heard. Um, I think what did we hear before that? Oh no, we didn't hear anything before that. Um, Mike, you want to tell us what's going on with uh, Mutants of War right now? Um, lots of stuff. We got tons of gigs coming up this summer. Well, tell, we're tell in the us that, man, because I. Uh, All right. Um, has some too, let's man. see. I think uh, we got the 29th right here in Orange County in Fullerton. August 2nd with Madras. Uh, it's gonna be a fun show, so come out. Right. Uh, July 13th with Madras again in San Francisco. For it's gonna be our first time ever going to San Francisco. As like a band, like playing there, so yeah, with a uh, hatchet and with hatchet, uh, yeah. uh, fog of war, I think. Right, yeah. So that's gonna be really fun. So yeah, uh, and then uh, August thirtieth, if if all works out, we should be going down to uh, Arizona, uh, be, the middle awesome. of nowhere. Um, oh, and play with Warhead, right? Yeah, with Warhead. Nice. Well, hopefully we can get on that too. Yeah, we, so we'll work it out. We'll get we'll, up. We'll, uh, we'll get to going. But uh, yeah, man. So. Um, yeah, dude, it's gonna be awesome, man. I'm excited be, for all the shows it's coming. It's gonna be a up. busy summer. Well, so uh, uh, all you people should head out to some shows because yeah. uh, I mean it's busy for us, but there's a million other bands who are just as busy this summer. So support your local music. Yeah, support your local scene. Uh, here in a minute, I'm going to uh, play something on uh, YouTube or whatever. Since I don't have a physical copy of it, I'm gonna play some uh, some stuff from my my buddy uh, Mark Manzo. We're gonna uh, we're gonna do some Power Throne here in a minute. Um, we're, with, we're gonna uh, buy some time because you didn't queue it up. We're gonna buy some time because I have to EQ it real quick. So, you want to show me how to? Uh, how do I? Uh, okay, plug it in there. I'll. Uh, this is amateur radio. This, this is amateur radio. So, let's uh, let's let's do this here. Let's um, let's do some power throwing with women, woman in white. On KTST Thursday night takeover. On Poppet's Corner KTST. Let's touch for the 
Metal Church off the uh, the Badlands with uh, that was a uh, Badlands off Blessing in Disguise. So, gotta love Metal Church, right, man? Oh yeah, there you we're go. learning. We're learning slowly, right? I'm, uh, red light on. Yeah, red light on. There uh, we go. Yeah. You're on a Thursday night takeover with your host Tanner Poppet on Poppet's Corner. <laughs> I have uh, Mr. Mike Weikert. Weikert. There you go. I'm you know, slowly getting We got there. this. We We've only this. known each other for um, like three years. So we're going to be uh, heading out shortly. So um, anything else you want to say? No, nah, man. Uh, just uh, go ahead and check out some of these bands we played, you know, especially Mutants of War. Yeah. Especially Mutants of War. Go check them out. And Madras, uh, check us out on Facebook. Uh, keep an eye out for shows because if you guys aren't showing up to the shows, the clubs get shut down and then we just, and then we we can't just play sit our music, at home and you know? drink and... We it's no fun. Yeah, well, we it is fun, but well, we can't nothing happens. play our tunes to, to other people, so... Please to go out and, and support the uh, local scene here in a minute. Uh, I want to th- uh, thank Benny right here for uh, for letting me do this. So uh, thank you, man. Appreciate it. Uh, hopefully, I'll be I'll be back uh, sometime next month to uh, for a Thursday night takeover on uh, Poppet's Corner. So uh, <laughs> please uh, tune in. And we'll uh, get the dates out for you. But I'm going to end it with um, with uh, my band actually. So everybody seems to like this tune. This is Zombie Grinder on KTST. Ah. 